Hi, I'm Gavin Nielsen. Uh, this time around I did a little model of a micro mouse in 3D and I wanted to just kind of run through just real fast what this is uh, and what's in the model and then I'll do a deep dive series on it sometime later, sometime soon, but uh, not right now. So basically I, I have a model, um, I have a, uh, a subsystem that has motor control, which includes logic and PWM controller and H-bridge. Um, it also includes, of course, the motor model itself, um, and it includes a uh, multi-step transmission with uh, gearing inertia. Um, and then, so I have two of those, and then I have a, a 3D system that basically takes into account the, the five rigid bodies, the platform, um, two drive wheels, a stability wheel, and the plane the, the, of, that it's driving on top of, and then how they interact with um, friction and, and uh, all that sort of thing. And so my drive, my drive system is actually interacting and driving the 3D system. And what's kind of fun about this is that I also connected up some dashboard components so I can drive it in real time. So just a couple of, uh, a couple, well, let's give it a shot and I'll show you what I'm talking about. So I'm gonna hit go here. And uh, these are the, the motor commands. I'm in forward right now. You can see it just dropped down. Um, and I can turn one motor up and you can see it turning over this way. I can turn the other guy on and we can actually go faster that way. I can reverse that motor. Um, I can, we can go really fast that way. I can use one motor to have it brake and that way we can pivot around one wheel or I can have them both in coast mode. So now only one, oops, there, coast mode. That way only one wheel is pushing. Um, so Oh, yeah, coast to zero, zero. So anyway, uh, this is kind of a, a fun thing, and um, I'm enjoying... Oh, come on. Get these guys going the way they need to go. There it goes. So now I can... Um, now I can steer it around and get it to go where I want it to go. And this is a full 3D... Um, full 3D environment. Um, I can pan zoom and all that kind of stuff. Um, and uh, what I'm going to do is wrap a, a three, or excuse me, a, a controller around this so it can navigate a maze ultimately. We'll do it in a couple of series. So anyway, that's it for, for now and I'll talk to you soon.